changes around us. We see a lot of changes from falling of leaves, from trees to blossoming of flowers. Our human body also undergoes a lot of changes like a child grows into a full grown adult. These are the natural changes and they cannot be reversed. For example, an adult cannot become a child again. But do you know that there are some changes that can be reversed? Take a balloon and blow air into it. The balloon gets filled with air and becomes big. Then through the nozzle, let the air escape. It gets back to its original shape. Take a paper and fold it to make a paper plane. After some time, unfold the paper plane and the paper gets back to its previous shape. This shows that some changes can be reversed. Let us perform the same experiments again. For the balloon, instead of letting the air escape, prick a pin and burst it. The balloon loses its previous shape. Instead of folding and making a paper plane, cut it into desired shapes. The structural change in the paper cannot be reversed. Let's take some more examples. If you crack an egg open, the yolk and the egg white cannot be made into an egg again. We can convert grains into flour but we cannot derive the grain from the floor. Now do you notice the differences between reversible and irreversible change? Look around you and observe all the changes that come under reversible and irreversible change.